stupid, stupid. Looks like I can't go that way. Looks like I can't go that way. Kid has left his fishing rod.
fishing rod. Yes! A metallic cross charred by lightning. Children are free of you! It looks like the statue from the tower. Thank you for saving us, Matt. Now that Mother is destroyed, the children are slowly returning to normal. 
We've all gone through the tunnel to join the rest of the world. I waited for you. Yes, but where are we going? Max? It's me, Morgan. I'm right here. Asylum? How did I get back here? Those children seemed so real. Did I save them, or am I going completely mad? Is he wearing big bare feet slippers? Excuse me, what's your name? Are you serious, man? I'm the king. King of what? King of rock and roll, man. I'm Elvis. The Elvis? But I thought you were, uh, well, you know, dead. No, that was all a hoax, man. The pressure was getting to me. I needed a break. Break from what? All your fame? Fame, drugs, food, you name it. I needed time to relax, sober up, slim down. Know what I mean? Yes. Well, it looks like you've shed a few pounds since that Hawaiian concert. Thank you. Thank you very much. Where is that awful music coming from? I wish I knew, man. That stuff is for the birds. Do you know anything about the other patients? They ain't patients. These are my fans, man. Let me tell you, these are the best fans in the world. The water fountain looks nasty. Doesn't anybody maintain this place? Nice tutu, old man. Excuse me, what's your name? Skippy! Where is that awful music coming from? I don't know, Q-Tip. Q-Tip? Yeah! Your big cotton head looks like it belongs in a big ear! <laughs> Do you know anything about the other patients? Do you know anything about the other patients? Very funny, old man. Very funny, old man! <laughs> Ugh, smells down there. That guy looks like he's gonna eat me. Excuse me, what's your name? Stan Dombrowski, don't forget it. Where am I? The courtyard. I'm not crazy. I shouldn't be here. Shut up before I pound you one. Where is that awful music coming from? Doc's doing some kind of test in the observation room. Oh? What kind of test? How should I know, maggot? I know this will sound nuts, but I was just in this weird little town where a, a huge alien plant killed all the adults but not the kids. Ah, uh, shut up! I'm not crazy. I shouldn't be here. Shut up before I pound you one. Interesting. Interesting. Not a friendly looking guy at all. Excuse me, what's your name? Why do you damn loons always gotta talk so damn much? Christ! My name's Hector, Hector Vasquez. Now get the hell away from me, you look like a goddamn mummy. Why is my head all wrapped up like this? Cause you're so freaking ugly, I guess. <laughs> okay, mummy man, I'll be straight with you. You see, when the little green men came to... Ah, uh, forget it, you jerk. Where am I? Where do you think? The asylum, you nut job. Where is that awful music coming from? You mean you don't see the orchestra full of pink elephants? 
very funny. I guess you lost your sense of humor when you lost your marbles. I know this will sound nuts, but I was just in this weird little town where a, a huge alien plant killed all the adults, but not the kids. Good for you. Why don't you go back there? I'm not crazy. I shouldn't be here. Hey, don't blow ahead, Pipe Psycho. That act won't get you anywhere with me. Excuse me, what's your name? John Whitewood, Max. Don't you remember? No, I'm sorry. Where am I? The asylum, of course. In the courtyard. We had to evacuate the tower cells because of the explosion. What explosion? The generator. It was supposed to be repaired this week. I guess they were a little too late. Oh, what about all the patients up there? I'm afraid you were the only one who survived, my friend. I'm the only survivor? My god! How many people died up there? I'd say 15 or so. The fire spread quickly after the second explosion. Then there was no way to reach them in time, but how did you manage to escape? If I told you, you'd think I'm really insane. Try me. I'd like to know how you survived this disaster. I know this will sound nuts, but I was just in this weird little town where a, a huge alien plant killed all the adults, but not the kids. I see. Ah, uh, you must think I'm as loony as the others. No, that's not true. I have my own theory on what could have happened to you. What's your theory? Well, I think that maybe your mind couldn't handle the thought of you abandoning those who needed help, so... You constructed a world to hide in, inside your mind, until it was safe to come back. The town represented the tower, the children were the patients, and the missing adults represented the doctors and other authority figures who weren't around to help. Huh, maybe you're right, but it all seemed so real. Your mind is capable of wondrous things, Max. In your head, it was real. I'm not crazy. I shouldn't be here. That's a familiar story around here, my friend. Where is that awful music coming from? Dr. Morgan is testing a few theories on how music affects the patients. He's conducting his research in the observation room. Quite a big fellow. Excuse me, what's your name? Jeez, Max. It's the same as it was yesterday and the day before that. I'm Bruce. Bruce Chambers, remember? Man, that wreck must have really rattled your brain. A car wreck? Yeah. Taking that nurse's car for a joy ride wasn't the brightest thing you've ever done. I mean, now your face is all messed up and you can't remember squat. Where am I? You've been here before, don't you remember? No, this place isn't familiar at all. It's the courtyard, Max. You like it here. Where is that awful music coming from? Well, the observation room. Dr. Morgan said that he was doing some auditory experiments. Whatever that means. I'm not crazy. I shouldn't be here. Now just calm down, Max. Calm down. But I'm not crazy. Sure you're not, Max. Sure. I know this will sound nuts. I was just in this weird little town where a, a huge alien plant killed all of the adults, but not the kids. You're right. You, you mean you believe me? No, I mean it sounds nuts. Just take your pill, Max, and you'll feel better. Are these gargoyles supposed to be conducive to sanity? The architect was probably an inmate. Are these gargoyles supposed to be conducive to sanity? The architect is probably an inmate. Are these gargoyles? How sad she looks. What kind of weird trees are these? That's no good. Doctor? 
Are you my doctor? Welcome back to the States, Max. I've already managed to assemble a team of top researchers at Mercy, but I'm especially glad that you finally decided to accept my offer. Dr. Law. Doctor, are you all right? I am a doctor. Oh, I'm, I'm okay. Thank you. Yes, I am a doctor, but I don't work here. Oh, I was hoping you were a new doctor. Since my friends stopped talking to me, I've been so lonely. I need someone to cure him so he could talk to me again. Who is your friend? Crag. Well, what's wrong with him? Does he have laryngitis? I... I don't know. Maybe. All I know is that he hasn't visited or talked to me in a while. Has Crag gone away? Maybe he was released from the asylum and didn't tell you. No. He wasn't a patient here. He just used to visit me by the fountain on sunny days. Why are you so lonely? I mean, there are other people here to talk to. I don't like them. They're all crazy. Crag was different. He was tall, dark, and handsome. He thought I was pretty. I'll bet you are pretty. Under that heavy hood, why do you hide your face? Since Craig stopped visiting me, I don't want to show my ugly face to anyone. Oh, stop talking like that. You're not ugly. You're just being polite. You don't fool me. Where is that awful music coming from? Oh, you can hear it too. Thank goodness. I thought I was imagining it. Where is it coming from? Um... I don't know. Where do these big doors lead? It sounds like someone's inside. Preacher Bob is giving a sermon inside. I wanted to go into the chapel myself, but the doors are stuck. I can't budge them. How did the preacher get inside if the chapel doors are stuck? He must have had help from his little lackey. Norm. Whoa, those are some big doors. What kind of weird trees are these? Why is that woman licking her lips? I feel very sane in comparison to her. Can't go that way. The path is blocked. Excuse me, what's your name? My name is Vera. I think it sounds nice. I ate my husband with carrots and rice. Where is that awful music coming from? I like this music. It's got a great beat. It makes me want to stay on my feet. Do you know anything about the other patients? They'd be yummy in my tummy. What do you mean by that? Chop them all up, put them in a pot, add some potatoes and see what you've got. Uh, okay. Talk to you later. Bye. He looks way too attached to that fish. Excuse me, what's your name? <coughs> uh, uh, sir, yes sir. Eh? Who the hell are you? Leave me alone. Can't an old man get any rest around this ship? Where is that awful music coming from? <coughs> uh, quit talking to me. I need to sleep off me hangover from shore leave. Some sort of control box for these water lines. I'll need something to pry it open.
looks like a doctor. What's he writing? Hello? You must be Dr. Morgan! Hmm? Oh. We thought we'd lost you in the fire, Max. Where have you been? I... I was somewhere else for a while. Well, it's good that you're safe, Max. But you seem to get into trouble whenever you go away. I've told you before that you need to stay in control if you expect to get well. I didn't just go away in my mind, Dr. Morgan. I was in an actual place, a small town with children. They were real, they... Now, Max, don't get all excited. I can have one of the orderlies restrain you if necessary. Will it be necessary, Max? No, I'm fine. I want to get well, Doctor, but I have so many strange thoughts, unanswered questions. Curiosity is a good thing, Max. I wish I had some answers for you. Perhaps we can talk later, after my work here is done. What fire? What happened? The generator exploded. <sighs> Too bad about all of those others up there in the tower. We could only save so many. Others? What do you mean? Don't you understand, Max? The fire. It wiped out all of the cells in the tower. Everyone inside. You're lucky to be alive. No one seems to be bothered by this. Does anyone know what happened to make the generator explode? We haven't discovered the cause yet, but of course we're concerned about all the patients. Right now we're trying to keep everyone calm and pleasant. Don't want them to dwell on disturbing things, do we? No, surely not. What are you writing, Doctor? I'm conducting an experiment. The effects of different types of music on all the patients. A record. Bella Donna in A flat. A record. Rockabilly swing thing. A, re A record. Rockabilly swing thing. Long live the king. A radio. Wonder if I can get any news from the outside world. Active only in newborns, DNAB goes on to deform, cripple, and kill victims within a few years. Active only in newborns, DNAV goes on to deform, cripple, and kill victims within a few years. What do you think about the record that's playing now? <coughs> How the hell should I know? I was sleeping till you came over and woke me, you big lunkhead! Interesting. What do you think about the record that's playing now? Knock, knock. Who's there? Boo. Boo who? Oh, don't cry. The music's not so bad. <laughs>
What do you think about the record that's playing now? Well, all right. It makes me want to shake my hips like I did on the solo the show. Iron Gate. Don't want the bad people to get out. about the record that's playing now. I don't like it, but it's okay. I'll dance again some other day. A record, the Donner Party Waltz. A record. Bella Donna in A record. A record. Bella Donna in A flat. A record. A record. The Ballad of Captain Dick. A record. The Ballad of Captain Dick. I hope he only dances with the fish. Another leaky pipe. Someone should fix that, too. What do you think about the record that's playing now? Ah, now there be a melody any good sailor would dance a jig to. Another leaky pipe. Someone should fix that, too. It sounds... What do you think about the record that's playing now? It sounds like the ocean and makes me feel sad. Cause I'm stuck here forever for being so bad. Are these gargoyles supposed to be conducive to sanity? The architect was probably an inmate. Water fountain looks nasty. Doesn't anybody maintain this place? What do you think about the record that's playing now? I'll tell you what, man. That there music sounds like the noise that alley cat made when my mama ran over it with a pink caddy. What do you think about the record that's playing now? Oh, it's making me seasick! Bella Donna in A flat. Very disturbing. Yet I 
can't look away. What do you think about the record that's playing now? Or it makes me dream of life under the sea. What do you think about the record that's playing now? The music keeps bouncing around in my head. It makes me wish that I were dead. What do you think about the record that's playing now? I'll tell you what, man. This music makes me sicker than a hound dog. Aha! Look what Skippy had under his tutu. I don't think that's the... How am I supposed to get there? Holy symbol. Ugh, smells down there. A hope. That would hurt. What do you think about the record that's playing now? I love it. It makes me very happy. Reminds me of my late wife, Evelyn. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you miss her? Miss her? Ha! That old bad sex? <laughs> I'm delirious with joy that she kicked the bucket before me! <laughs> Disciple of Bob? What faith is that? It is the truth. Bob's word is truth. 
He is the eyes and ears of God. Oh, glorious and most holy of Bobs. Bob is the most Bob of all. Hallelujah. Praise be to Bob. The preacher seems to be interested in the sin of stealing. Did something happen? Oh, a most foul and wicked occurrence has befallen our most majestic and glorious house of worship. A sinful calamity of wretched thievery and deception has spirited away the holiest of holy tokens from the house of Bob. Okay. Thanks for clearing that up for me. Brother Norman, look! I think I found the holy symbol. What? Oh, praise be to Bob! Preacher, preacher! The symbol has been returned to the house of Bob! Excuse me, what's your name? My name? Disciple Norman, this lost sheep seeks the truth. Seek the truth, preacher! Amen, Norman! I go by many names, my child, but you may call me Preacher Bob. I've found your lost symbol, preacher. What's that? Praise the Lord indeed! Praise the Lord! Come forward, my son. For your performance of a miracle in our accursed times, I dub thee Saint Max of the House of Bob. Here is thy staff of righteousness. Lean on it whilst you walk on the path of the Lord. Hallelujah! Thanks. I'll, uh... <clears throat> I'll use it for the good of mankind. Hallelujah! Amen! Your parishioners seem a little, um... wooden. The lost sheep doesn't recognize the flock, Brother Norman. Open his eyes, Father. Amen to that. My flock is special in the eyes of the Lord, my son. Right now, they sit motionless in deep prayer. So strong is their devotion that they appear to be made of wood to the common man. But in truth, they are as alive as you and I. I'm okay, if you say so. Why'd they chain his hands to his feet? These are just mannequins. These are just mannequins. These are just mannequins. Seems rather eccentric. Men! All those who came before me were thieves and robbers, but the sheep would not listen to them. I am the gate. Whoever enters through me will be saved. He will come in and go out and find pasture. The thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. I have come that they may have life and have it to the people be saved. Saved. playing now. I love it. It makes... Oh. Miss. A record.
you think about the wreck? Or it makes me dream of life under the sea. This is a confusing mess. These pipes, they must control the water flow to the fountain. Gargoyles supposed to be conducive to sanity? The architect was probably an inmate. These pipes, they must control the water flow to the fountain.
dried up and depressing. Save game. Return to game. These pipes, they must control the water flow to the fountain. up and depressing. These pipes, they must control the water flow to the fountain. up and depressing. These pipes, they must control the water flow to the fountain. These pipes, they must control the water flow to the fountain.
dried up and depressing. These pipes, they must be... up and depressing. These pipes...
dried up and depressing. These pipes.
pipes. Right up these pipes. It looks so much nicer when it's filled. The reflection is moving. I wish I understood. Ah, my spirit has been so dry. I do not know you, sir. But I thank you. What is your greatest wish? I wish that I could see my sister again. Max? Sarah would like to see you now. Better? I don't think I can go to the circus this year. We'll go next year. <laughs> can you do me a favor, Max? Dolly, the one Dad won me the last year at the circus, Mr. Clown, could you get it for me in the toy box? Oh yeah, sure. I can't find it, Sarah. I can't... I can't find it. I can't find it. I can't find it.
What's happening to me? <gasps> Load save game.